I posted a video on rating watches for Celestial Navigation, specifically a Casio F91W, a W86 and two fake F91Ws. I placed the watches in a desk drawer at room temperature and every week recorded their time compared to network time using high-speed videos. I measured the effect of temperature by placing the watches for a week in a freezer at minus 17.5 degrees centigrade. But I did not regulate the temperature in the desk drawer, which varied between about 12 and 17 degrees. I had planned to measure the effect of watch orientation, but that did not prove to be possible with my previous rating, because the effect of the daily variation in the temperature of the room could not be distinguished from it. So I took the four watches and placed them in a temperature-controlled incubator at 20.1 degrees centigrade for four weeks. For the first week they were face up, for the second face down, then right edge down and finally another week face up. The extra face up week was for control purposes to make sure there was nothing else affecting the rating over time and there wasn't. These are the results plotted as drift in seconds per day. Yellow and green are the fake F91Ws. Blue is the real F91W and red is the W86. Again the fakes were much less accurate overall with daily drifts around 1.5 to 2 seconds. But that seems to be because of poor calibration as the effect of position was very similar on all four watches. They all gain time most when position on their edge with the right side of the dial down and least when face down with the face up position being intermediate. The difference between right down and face down for all watches was surprisingly similar at 0.65 seconds per day. The difference between right down and face up was fairly close to half a second per day for all watches. That's a pretty significant effect when you compare to the temperature coefficient. My estimate of the temperature coefficient was a pretty crude one because quartz crystal temperature coefficients are not typically linear with temperature and I simply made measurements at minus 17 and a half degrees and plus about 15 degrees centigrade. But from that crude estimate, the effect of the difference between having the face oriented right edge down versus face down is about the same as a 4 degree change in temperature. If you're using a watch as a nautical chronometer for astral navigation and you require accuracy to within one second over a period of weeks, then the watch not only needs to be kept at the same temperature in some form of incubator arrangement, but also kept the same way up, both for rating it before you set sail and on board. At least that's if you're using these inexpensive watches. I have one other Casio, a WV59, on rating at the moment. This is a more expensive model and so far it's looking very impressive. It may take the prize as the real navigator's watch. I'll report soon.